suddenly I found myself on the chest of Jesus. Like John, the beloved, I could feel my face up against his linen robes, the soft fabric around my face. I could hear his heart, the sound of eternity, that gigantic chamber of love embracing me. I felt so loved, so protected. This intimacy of his heart went deep into my very being, leaning, leaning deeper into his heart. I could feel his arms embracing me. And then I could feel his heart open up. And I'm drawn into the literal heart of Jesus. The eternal residence of this tremendous heartbeat. This heartbeat is resounding through all of eternity. The tapestry of sounds and rhythms. The celestial worship. Oh, the worship. The glory. His heart was a literal chamber of chanting of prayers. A tabernacle of glory. The ancient of days. This Jewish king. I was inside of his heart. The incense, the thick, heavy smells began to overwhelm my senses. The chantings, the awakening of my heart to these ancient prayers to God. Holy. I'm going deeper into the thick smoke. I began to perceive that these walls and this tabernacle, that they're not made of stone, but they're made of flesh. His heart was gigantic. This gigantic wall, like heaven's wailing wall. Every name, every individual, every face, every destiny, every dream was written on the wall of the Lord's heart. But then I could hear the intercessors crying out from the lost from the earth down below. I could hear them crying out, Oh Lord, Lord my Father, Lord, my father, he doesn't know you. Lord, my mother, she's in so much pain. My children. I could hear the cries and the groans of the intercessors crying out for the lost. Lord, do you hear their cries? Will you save them? There's so much pain. There's so much anguish. And then I can hear the Lord's heart responding. His heart was breaking. This heaven's wailing wall. It was as though the whole wall was bleeding and crying and groaning in the depths of his being. Each one of the names written on his heart he goes, I know your circumstances. I know each one of you so intimately. I feel your pain. I know the anguish. I know the pain you're going through. Will you come to me? You are not forsaken, come to me, I love you.